her definitive grace. VAR is searching for an offside where there's actually a foul for a penalty. I mean, it's absolutely fabagastic. I mean, you, you, you can't, you can't think these things, you can't make them up. Welcome, Sports Nation, to Sports DTM, the sports channel where we call sports down the middle. You can expect the latest in sports news, views, and reviews from our resident analysts. No sports topic is too controversial, and no team or player is above criticism. So just smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on our balanced offering of riveting sports content. And don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment below. Welcome to Sports DTM. So, our first in the series of You've Been Varred tonight is the decision of a no goal call against Liverpool versus Brighton in the EPL, with Salah shadow appears to be over the line. And the VAR, it was referred to VAR, and they said it was offside. So, is this varred or not? Or you've been varred or not? Eddie, what are your takes on this image right here? All right, on this one, um, it looks to be pretty close, but I'll give it to VAR. I think they got it right. Of course. Um, Salah, size 10, shoes, just, you know, crossing the line there. So he's offside. Good call. So we need a magnifying glass on this, but Tiga, your take on this, offside or not? This is a clear offside. All right. If you are the referee, if you are the referee on the on the um the the left hand side looking down, you would have seen that the player is behind the first one, right? The um the, that Salah getting the ball, right? The ball is playing to Salah, right? You see that he's behind the player, he's behind the, the, the first the player that's in front of him. If you're if you're an referee on the on the left hand side, if you are the referee on the right hand side. I don't know which cause you know it's dead on the, on both sides. I don't know where the referee will be. If you are the referee on the right hand side, and if you're looking up, right, you can see that Salah is clearly over the um is 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 before the two player. The referee he, on the right hand is. side would be at the half line, sir. You can see that he would not all be right. over that side. All right, no, all right, fine. All right, so if you're the play, if, if he's on the left hand side, then if he's on the left hand, as I say, I don't know where the referee will be. He's on the right side. Look, look at the top of the picture. He's at the right side. Yeah, he's on the top, right? With if the he's on the top, yeah. yeah. yeah all right, thank you. Right if he's on the, on the top, you see that Salah is outside because oh, he's man. before the player. Oh, stop it. No, oh, come on, man. He's, oh, all right. Yeah. If, if yeah. you're a referee, if you're a referee on the right hand side of the top, Adrian, looking yeah. down, who would you see? This is this is Salah in front. Do you see other player? You, you don't you see thought, other player. You Come thought, on, oh, stop, stop, stop. You think you saw the referee call it? It's not the line. It's not the assistant referee called this one, you know. The assistant referee made it go through. Yeah, but yeah, but uh, that's why they use VAR. Never realized uh, that. Yeah, but they can't the, the referee. They can't. Hold well, on, they can't say line man make a mistake. You got when we were children, you gave me a T square. A T square to the drawing. Apparently, I need to pull out that T square, pull out my compass, pull out uh, my protractor. I mean, pull out my ruler, pull out my line, all the instruments to actually see Salah's big toe. I mean, this is just a little too much. God. Rocky, it's still up. But there's a toenail. Right. But it now comes down to who's so it's bigger, it's bigger and who's and it's bigger who's no. more than who's. Sometimes, so, so. sometimes they must give the attack that's part the life. That's part of life. That's why. That's why it's not working. So before before I hear your your take, Higgins, I just want to let the fans out there know if you're not familiar with offside, offside is law number eleven of the, the game, right? And a player is deemed to be in an offside position if any of their body parts, except the hands or harm, are in an, the opponent's half of the pitch and closer to the opponent's goal line than both the ball and the second last opponent. And second last opponent, them counting the keeper in there. So you're deemed to be in an offside position if that's the case. 
and a, an important part of it is if um, you're gaining any advantage. I, I'm not sure, apparently they're leaving that part of the law out. So if you're gaining right. any advantage by your toe being uh, more advanced than the defender, I don't know. So, so again, let me hear your view on this. VAR was right or wrong? VAR must sometimes give the attacker the benefit of the doubt. I don't know. I don't see how they separated um, Salah from the defender before the, 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 the he received the ball. And but even, but, but in that position, hold on. Even, even hold in on. That position. If you're looking so, at the ball, you can see that the ball is coming off the player's foot. Not and necessarily. Definitely not outside might have been controlling the ball. It, the ball <laughs> might have been in the air. And he's controlling the ball, getting ready to pass it. Ray, right. is this a definite offside? Right. The word definite, yeah, I wouldn't necessarily use that word a definite. But it is an offside by, air, by the air, you know, inches, whatever, millimeters. Microscopes type stuff, it is one. Telescope even, but it is. VAR have it right. <laughs> so again, again, we're calling out VAR. If you're going to show where a solar foot is on the pitch, we also want a, micros a microscope on where the ball is on the passer's foot. So we want to see both of them at the same time so that we can say, yes, Salah was in an offside position when the ball was placed, but broke it. VAR got it right or wrong in this case? Absolutely wrong. You're speaking as a Liverpool <laughs> fan, right? <laughs> hey. I thought oh, boy. we were doing this Don Amigo thing. I thought we were doing... <laughs> right. Why, why are you introducing... I'm going, I'm going right down the middle. DTM fans, I want to hear your comments on this one. Uh, and, and, Did well, VAR get it right? are wrong leave your comments in the section below let us know if var got it right or wrong in this incident the second incident that we're in our series of you've been barred is this west ham versus aston villa match where ali watkins was deemed to be offside because his jersey was too long for his hand i want to hear your take quickly ray was this an offside or even a penalty? Well, well, um, the latter. You know, I would rather <laughs> than look for a search for a penalty because um, with all those lines drawn by VAR, there shouldn't be any real argument to say this, was, this wasn't an offside. I, this is very clear to me. I'm seeing where the jersey lines are and all of that stuff. I would absolutely give VAR excellent drawing and all. And I concur. So it's best they, they, they ask for a penalty in this scenario and not the outside. Okay. Sure, this is a disgrace. Bar is searching for an offside where there's actually a foul for a penalty. I mean, it's absolutely propagandistic. I mean, you, you, can't, you can't think these things, they can't make them up. You're unable to get a proper call if you have referees who are looking to actually um, make a call for an offside with a clear and obvious foul for a penalty. This Eddie, so, so what, what Brooke is saying, Eddie, VAR took the crowd. Yeah, man, definitely. VAR, I think VAR enjoyed doing the lines because yeah. they have a clear, clear call for a penalty and they, they refuse to make it. But they want to do the fancy blue and yellow lines. Blue, so yellow, red lines. Tiga, this is a definite penalty again. Are a penalty this. Are I, don't know what, I, I don't know what VAR is thinking. This is a penalty. I, I thought you guys were going to say it's a half side. But this is a I don't this is nothing like a half side, but this penalty is a penalty. Is I don't know what VAR is thinking here. As I say, it's a, the referees are poor in the EPL. They understand poor referee in this. Again, the, the decision on this one was offside against Ali Watkins. Fans out there, I want to hear your take on this. Was this was this a right call by VAR or a wrong call by VAR? Just give us your feedback in the section below. Let us hear your comments on the decisions by VAR 
do you like what VAR has added to football or you're falling out of love or you just want to get rid of VAR completely? Let us know if there are any changes that you would recommend to VAR. Also, just put it in the section below because FIFA will be reading this. All right, so this has been another episode of Sports Down the Middle. Continue to follow us, continue to support us, and we thank you very much for your support. Like, subscribe, follow, share with a friend, to share with a friend that the, the new kids on the block are here with exciting stuff for you. Bless.